Hey guys, it's your girl April. So today's video is going to be kind of like a mixture of things, different items. It's going to be like a show and tell haul mixture, whatever you want to call it. Yes. So yes, I wanted to share them with you guys because I am like super excited about that like open up some more window space here yes let the sun in if you guys know a lot of youtubers we always are on camera but a lot of us don't wear bottoms so like yeah we sit here we look great we have on a nice shirt sometimes we don't have an entire outfit on like me today I am not wearing an outfit I do have on my undergarments and my shirt and my head scarf I will be going somewhere after this but for right now it is what it is because I'm in my room so yes like I was saying I did get some things in the mail as well as I did did take myself to the store and get some things but the first things I want to show you and share with you is from one of my very close friends Miss Shayla she did send me because she knows I love to do makeup videos especially the affordable affordable ones beauty on a budget so I try to do videos that are more affordable because there are loads of drugstore brand makeup out there that will suit the makeup look and makeup wearer okay and as well as their pockets so yes that is me so she sent me her favorite because she loves wet and wild and i have a few wet and wilds not as many as she does but a lot of them so she sent me the new palettes which came out and i'm just going to show you these guys because you can get these at your local drugstore um pharmacy so this one here is melrose night five different shades and they're actually so pretty um very neutral colors um it does tell you where you can place them at on your eye you don't have to follow the instructions but if you want to you're a beginner this is always beginner friendly and very very pigmented as well so look at that really colorful they show up really well on camera and so forth and i do like them a lot and I have six of them, so bear with me, okay? So I'm just going to wipe them on my leg here. Oh, no, I have something. Okay. This one here is called High Waisted Jeans. <laughs> so it's more or less like very dark denim-like colors, blues, and I think this one is purple and a silver color right here. Really pretty colors. Um, I think that Wet n Wild is like $2.99 a palette, if I'm correct. Angels in Arbogan, I think that's how you say it. This one, I do like this pink right here and this kind of like maroonish shimmer color. Oh my God, these are like so pretty. Look at that. Those are beautiful colors. Really pretty. Yeah, so I will get some makeup looks out with these ladies so that way you can get to your local drugstores and pick these products up. The Naked Truth, La Pure Verte. That's that's what it says, okay? Now, this is something that I would probably use all the time because you guys know I love me some neutral eyes. I have neutral eyes today. This is actually my Motives palette that I haven't used in like um, a year, like a year. Very beautiful color browns. I love neutral colors. With neutral colors, you cannot go wrong with. They are just never a miss. They're always a hit. You can wear them with just any color. Floor, floral Values Boutique Floral. And this is also very pretty colors. Purples and pinks. And this pink right here is really cute. It reminds me of the last palette somewhat. Just a little bit lighter, but very pretty still. Now these are just a little bit lighter in color, but really gorgeous colors. I like these shades. I am like super excited, okay? I just did like the Dollar Tree makeup look. Yes, hunties. And this one right here, I think is my favorite. My daughter Tati said the same thing that this was her favorite. Smoke and Melrose. Do you see these colors? Like this is kind of similar to the first one, which was Melrose Night. Oh yeah, look at that. Smoke and Melrose. Melrose Night. So they're very similar. Very, very similar. I love this one. OMG. Oh. Yes! 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 Okay, yes, bitches. Ooh, so pretty. Like, this is gorge. I love this crease color. They said put this in your crease. I will put it mm, right there. 
it's so pretty so yes that's what i got in the mail so be prepared we will be doing some makeup looks with that okay i gotta find like a really good drugstore foundation okay because i really don't wear too many drugstore foundations so i have to find a really good one so the next thing that i got um which from the dollar tree i did the dollar tree makeup haul um a lot of the things are always there but i noticed that they had these la color bronzers they always have great stuff at the dollar tree and i do have other stuff but i wasn't really like too big on showing that because it really didn't have like a high payoff a color payoff but this one right here the la colors bronzers this is in the color bronze um yeah, it's called bronze. BSB 334. It's in the color called bronze. Really, really pretty. It has like a light shimmer to it, but it's a really cute. Oh, I don't want to show that finger because that's like giving you guys the finger. Really pretty color. It has a great color payoff. I did use it now. Is it going to be as pigmented as something like you would spend $40 for? Maybe not, but you know what? With cheaper makeup, sometimes with the Dollar Tree makeup, like LA Colors, sometimes you have to build it. Just like layering, you got to layer that shit on. Can I just say that? Okay, whatever. Um, and this one here is called Baked. And it's not as frosted or not as shimmered. But I did use it as a contour color. So it is like a really great contour color. You know what I'm saying? So depending on your budget, you can get like a really great, nice little makeup collection going. Especially for like those who just started out. I wouldn't say go out and spend like major bucks on makeup just spend you know a little bit at a time so also i've been seeing this on youtube lately and i'm like okay i do love my satin powders i am like a huge fan of satin powders i somewhat liked ben nye banana powder somewhat but it gave me like this dry look afterwards so i'm back and forth i'm always on the fence i tried the by terry one it was supposed to be translucent please i look like i had cocaine on my face then i tried the la girls pro HD setting powder, same issue as the by Terry. Horrible, horrible. And I fell in love with these um, setting powders, kind of like setting powder by Morphe. It comes in their 9C contour highlight palette. I love that. I went to pan on it and got nothing left. Scraped the sides and I still have all the other colors and I'm done. But I have a thing to show you guys in a minute. But anyway, so I've been seeing this on YouTube like for a minute now and it's the Air Spun, okay? And you'd be amazed. It's $5.97 at Walmart. There are three different versions to this. This was the last color, and thank God it worked out for me. But it's naturally neutral, a beauty legacy since 1935. So the one thing, this is the original formula. Um, and what it smells like to me, I'm not really a huge fan on it, on the scent, because I really don't like for my facial products to have a scent to them. I just feel like it's gonna break my skin out if I do. I'm not I don't have like really sensitive skin but I really am kind of like cautious but so it does smell kind of like to me as soon as I opened it up it smelled like I smelt it and then it just brought back these old memories of when I was a child and I would go visit my godparents every summer for the entire summer and my godparents are older they're they're older they're like in their 70s and the, it was a husband and wife you know They've been together since they were teenagers. And, you know, she was an older lady, so she had perfume, of course. And as soon as I opened it, I sent, the scent just whiffed, just kind of like hit me in my face. It smelled like my godmother's perfume. But I will tell you this, this Naturally Neutral, I wore it today, I put it on today. What? Honeys. For $5.97, this stuff works bomb.com. Like, seriously? I was so surprised at the payoff and it did not leave me all chalky looking like I had powder and dust on my face. It actually came out so well. I was so impressed by this powder. Oh, look at my dog. Ooh. Okay, so I'm looking at my girl, Miss Shay Love. She looks so beautiful. You guys got to check her channel out because she is like the bomb, the best damn YouTuber ever. She has like the best attitude and I love her to pieces. She is so fucking pretty. Um, yes. So anyway, did I say that? 
Okay. This is really great. I love this for the price. It's really affordable. You get a lot of this in one little jar. You get 2.3 ounces. I did not use the puff. I used my beauty blender sponge by Real Techniques because I didn't want it all over the place. But I'm really highly impressed by this stuff right here. So yes, y'all. Also, what I did notice at Walgreens, um, I got a few products. I was there one night and I just wanted to see what they had on clearance. And I did get what they had on clearance, but I do see these products at the store as well as Ulta. But I never purchased them. But for some reason, now they have them in Walgreens. And the display kind of like stood out. Kind of like stood out. Which made me buy them. This time, I purchased them. I never buy them in Ulta. But I purchased them this time. So, Soap and Glory is now available at Walgreens. Okay? And because, like I said, it stood out. I decided to get their 4-in-1 um, Wash Deep Cleansing Milk. And it has this great scent to it. It's kind of like peachy. It melts away the makeup for all skin types. I uh, mean, if you have sensitive skin or what have you, hyperpigmentation, it's really great. And it is smooth. My kids, my daughters, they wash their face with this in the morning um, every day because it's really a soothing, soft kind of formula consistency. So I do like this. It is, I think it was like $12.99 at Walgreens. I'm not really sure how much is that Ulta, but it does they work. say you can take your makeup di directly off with this. I have not tried that yet because I just don't feel like this is going to do the trick for me. Plus, I really like to get on my eyelids a lot more with the wipe so I don't use it for that but it does make your skin feel really radiant and it does take out all the extra makeup and debris also I did get this I was going to get the bigger bottle but I said well for $12.99 I did not come here for all that I'm going to get this in a smaller size which is like a travel and this is the soap and glories um, face soap and clarity vitamin C facial wash 3 in 1 daily detox I absolutely I love this stuff it has like a little scrub in it meaning there are scrub um, there's like pink little kind of like you know sandy like type of scrub in it for your face but I do like this because it really really cleans my face and I normally use like certain products to clean my face but it's always nice to be able to change it up and see what else is out in the market so that way my skin doesn't get too used to one product and then I can't use anything else so yes this was like $3.99 at Walgreens and I did get this from Walgreens, the number seven beautiful skin cleansing water. This was $4.99 at Walgreens. It was like um, 90% off or something like that. I don't know, but I know number seven is quite expensive at Walgreens. To me, it's expensive because it's a drugstore brand. So to me, that's really expensive. Um, but yes, they have like some other new stuff some other new makeup brand there and it's also really kind of like pricey it kind of reminds you of like the benefit um brand um but i can't really remember the name of it but yeah if you know what i'm talking about then leave your comment below but i do like this so this is what i've been using to remove my makeup i'll spritz a little bit of this on my baby wipe and it removes your makeup like just right away um it doesn't leave any debris left behind um, sometimes I like to use my Neutrogena, but it's kind of oily, so, you know, I really don't want too much oil on my skin, so this I really do like. For the price, it was on clearance. Listen, I should have bought the last two bottles, but for now, this will work. So one of my higher-end purchases, which I did get a couple months ago, and I don't remember showing it on any video, but it is the Becca Cosmetics Champagne um, Pop or... Yeah, Champagne Pop Skin Perfector. And I absolutely love this highlight. Um, I have been using it a lot in my videos. And it's absolutely gorgeous. It's a very, very pretty color highlight. Um, today, I don't have it on um, because I decided to use something else that was basically the same exact price as this one. Um highlight um but you get more but i love jacqueline hill she is like one of my favorite youtubers she's so funny but for those of you who want to use highlighters but don't want a lot to spend don't want to spend a lot yes this one is gorgeous and it's probably like um 25 30 dollars i can't really remember i think it was like 25 30 dollars at sephora um and it does have a great color payoff but if you don't want to spend all of that on one actual highlighter then by all means check out one of my favorite sites which is morphe i seen this and i was like omg i have to have this so this is the daisy danger highlight palette from morphe oh my gosh i'm not really sure how popular this is out or this is now but this is like an amazing 
contour or highlight highlight palette rather babies you will glow to the gods and everybody else in this actual palette right here this was $25 and it was so worth it because you get nine shades of nothing but pure bliss glowing okay so I do have this on my face today and yes I'm feeling so freaking pretty right now so here we go. This palette is like so gorgeous and the colors on the camera cannot even just say or speak for themselves with this palette right here. Okay. Do I have to put that up close so you guys can see it? Now maybe on camera it doesn't look like it's so amazing. Like, you know, it's probably like, oh, it's just a palette. It just looks like any other color. Let's talk about this palette, okay? First of all, the price is so good for nine colors. Plus, as I was saying, remember I just said earlier in this video that I love a good pressed powder, a good setting powder, and I have one by Morphe in my 9C contour and highlight palette, but I went to pan on it, scraped the sides out and everything. I was so freaking happy when I noticed that it was here, right here. So this color right here is a matte color, and then the one next to it is more or less like a yellowish color, kind of like the banana powder, and they are both wonderful colors. They work all day. They don't leave you looking like flash mobbed, like you have white stuff on your face. They actually dull down and set into your skin and leave your makeup looking flawless all day long. Okay, now as for the other color that's in that 9C palette, I think it is this one right here, down here, because it does come on one of these. But let's just look at all of these. I'm going to swatch these for you. Oh my God, so there is this pink one right here, which is so cute. And this one right here, which is in the middle. And this one right here, which I also have on today. These colors are like gorge, gorge, gorge. So... Do you see those? What? Ugh. Oh, God. So pretty. If you was to put them on your face, you would be like, oh, my God. They're so, so, so gorgeous. And then as for the bottom ones, okay, so we have, I had to wipe my hands off a little bit here. So for this, this row, we have this color here, which is like a bronzy copper color. And then this one in the middle, which is like a champagne color. And as well as this one. These are kind of like similar to me. Um, they are very similar in color, but they're not. So for these three. So pretty. Oh, let me put them right here. They're really, really pretty colors. Like so pretty. I actually do like this palette a lot. And for $25, you get nine highlights. I'm pretty sure you're not going to use them all that fast. It comes in this really gray metallic like packaging. Okay, so that is it for the makeup um, portion of this video. Now on to um, one of my faves, which I love this company and I've done quite a um, a lot of reviews for them um, in the past, you know, over the past year or so. And this is Happiness Boutique. And they are a um, Germany-based fashion accessory website. However, if you guys are like, oh my God, this is international. I am not about to spend international shipping money. It's free shipping. So you don't have to worry about paying any extra coins because their shipping is free. They have the most exquisite jewelry for very, 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 very budget-friendly people. But I'm going to tell you what. I have this necklace that I've always worn by them. It has diamonds in it. I've had that necklace for over a year, and it has not tarnished yet. So I always wear a lot in my videos because I kind of like it to camouflage my scar right here because I'm self-conscious about it at times. Sometimes I'm really self-conscious. But anyway, first of all, I love their packaging. It comes in this box. I have every last box they sent me. And I love the fact that it comes with the same exact tissue 
tissue paper and this says for the lovely April hugs and kisses and it also has grandma's tips on jewelry care inside so that way you know how to care for your statement jewelry and it also has get a free gift of your choice by joining our reward program so I will post all the information of how you can get you know um, points and reward points and get a free gift by choice I love them they have like the best stuff and their packaging is always like perfectly on point the shipping is fast so if you're wondering does it take long to ship it took about a week for my stuff to come like I said this comes Comes from Berlin Germany um, they have so many nice things on there to choose from it's just like like overwhelming and one reason why I decided to wear the head wrap today is because I wanted to be able for you guys to see the earrings that I put I didn't want the hair to kind of like take away from it so these are the earrings that I did get from them and these are absolutely gorgeous they do come on one of their stock cards which do say their names and I do apologize if you cannot see this too well on camera I'm still trying to figure out how to use like all the features in this camera but I do like these because they're kind of like classy but then dress down like now I do like these because of the length of them and where they hang I do love anything gold and like I said their jewelry does not tarnish like that and I've had their earrings and their jewelry for over a year and a lot of pieces I wear on a daily basis now these are something like I said you can wear them dressed down or dressed up they go well with my wrapped headscarf which is kind of fancy today in case you guys have noticed but I do like these because they're not overbearing and they're not too gaudy now the next earring is just one I love the cuff earring but with these they actually clip a little bit different so this is how these clip right here really really a lot easier and they don't hurt my ears like that and they actually do stay on to my earlobe as well so they're made really really well you don't need to have a pierced ear for these these are absolutely gorgeous you only get one with this particular one there are some pairs that you do get two that I have from um, happiness boutique I Okay, so like I was saying, you don't need to have a pierced ear for this one because it does not have a stem piece. It does have the two clips, and these are so much comfortable. I'm not sure. A lot of people love to wear these, and they bother me. Like the ones that I've purchased, they actually do bother me. But when I wear the ones from Happiness Boutique, they fit a lot more comfortable on my earlobe. So I do like theirs. And with this one here, I would just put in a smaller diamond earring on the opposite side and wear them. Super duper cute. And the last item that I have, I love their um, necklaces. I do wear a lot of their necklaces in my videos. Um, not so as you can see, this one right here, it's so pretty. It is a statement piece, but not as blinged out as like a lot of other pieces that I have worn. And I do love a statement piece that you can wear with just about anything. And this is one of those pieces. But it's more or less a piece that you can just basically just fit into almost any wardrobe. You can wear this with a really nice pair of jeans and a t-shirt because it's not too much and it will still look cute. There does have an elastic, um, excuse me, an elastic band. It does have an extension in the back so that way if you want it tighter or longer, you can go ahead and do so and change that. And like I said, I will post all of their information below. Okay, and so for the last items, I do have two boxes of these, which is from PinchMe.com. This is a website where you try products from leading brands for free, and you can get something different every month. It all depends on the surveys that you take. I do have two boxes from them. One of them I actually had and did not realize that I had. So this is like, I think, my third time getting a box from them. So in this box here that I did get like a couple of months ago, I'm really not sure when, I did get the Palms uh, Rejuvenate anti-wrinkle cream so these are not actual samples um, these are full-size products a lot of them are full-size products and then a lot of them are luxury size samples and I love that because even if it is a luxury size sample they're really great to travel with you you know if you're like going somewhere you don't want to carry a lot of things with you you're only going for a few days or even a week Things like this that are small like this, I love because you can take them every single place with you. Also in this box is the electrolyte tablets. This is just really good if you are suffering from dehydration. OMG, this is one of my favorite products. I actually have this in the full size product, the Garnier 
skin brightener moisturizer daily moisturizer i would carry this with me um if i was going somewhere also is the goddess garden organics natural sunscreen for kids broad spectrum of spf 30 um some greek hidden um hidden valley greek yogurt dressing which is ranch in here orchards valley harvest cranberry almond cashews well, i'm about to eat these as soon as i'm finished this video i'm about to eat these Clinical Strength um, Deodorant. This is the Clinical Strength Deodorant. This is really good and this is for those who need like a stronger deodorant. So in here is the Tom Sensitive Groundbreaking Sensitivity Relief. And this is for your teeth or Next Care Sensitive Skin. So there's like two band-aids inside of here. Um, Uracin in Shower Moisturizing Body Lotion which is another great sample to carry in your bag. All this stuff does come in handy. Now, for the recent box that I got, this one right here, Garden Organic. This is the Sun Repair Night Cream. So for those of you who love to sit out in the sun and fry your skin, then this one right here will just kind of moisturize and bring moisture back to your skin. Also, I did get Fache or Vichy Laboratories. So thank God I don't need this, okay, because... My skin does not look old. Another one of the products by Vichy Laboratories is the One Step Cleaning um, Solution. It's great for cleaning our faces when we remove our makeup. Some Blistics, um, Ultra Moisturizing Blistics. Um, I did get um, some a Tide Pod. I was going to say some. But I only got one. Do I like the pods? To be honest, no. I'm kind of old school. I'd rather have my detergent in a liquid form and I'll just pour it in the cap and pour it in the wash machine. I don't really think that these little pods are enough for a load of laundry. These sent to the Skin Mud Mask by Shea Moisture and you do get a um, $2 off coupon. This one had a bad had a bad night. Have a good morning. So these are basically wake me up pills. Uh, scrubbing a dishcloth by Scotch Bright. And last but not least in this bag is a pinch me tote, which is so cute. So yeah, you can carry your samples around in this or whatever you want. Pinchme.com. I will list all of the information for every last product that I featured on this video. And I do apologize if it turned out to be super long. Of course, it was a haul slash show and tell. Show off what I got, whatever you want to call it. Okay. So on that note, stay diva and delicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. And I will see you girls and guys in the next video. Bye.